One student, one goal. Save as much money as possible in one semester by renting, borrowing, and bartering everything they can. It's the rented life. Hey guys, it's David, your rented life student here. I am in front of my Beyonce poster, I don't know why. This month's challenge is for me to go on a cheap date. Um, uh, so I am planning on going on a date with my friend Amber, who is in my acting program. We just finished our realism project, which were these shows we worked on for like six weeks. It was really stressful, and we figured we really needed a dinner and a movie to just kind of let go of that stress and have an evening to ourselves. Now, definitely to keep the state on a budget, I needed to make sure that I got some good student discounts. So I went over to um, Yelp on my computer, and I did a little bit of research. Um, a good strategy was to just find student discounts and then choose my category. I ended up choosing the Loring Pop bar which is this really nice Italian restaurant in Dickey Town and they offer a 20% off student discount if you bring your student ID um, so that's definitely gonna save us a bunch of money and it's a pretty fancy place so it's not even like we're trying to cheapen up our fancy dinner next I did the same by searching student discount but this time I checked off performing arts and cinema and I found that st. Anthony Maine which is one of the more popular theaters actually gives out six dollar tickets for people with student IDs so dinner and a movie it's looking like it's gonna be pretty cheap anyway I'm gonna go Go through on a coat and then we can get right to meeting Amber and me having my little date night with her. Hello Amber! Hello! See guys she has a bike too! It's a thing! There's mine, there's hers, bikes! So how do you feel now that your show's closed? Um it's great to have a life again. How have you saved money lately? I've learned to like buy lots of pasta and things like come in bulk that you can use for like plenty of meals. Leftovers are a girl's and a guy's best friend. Oh my god, because it's food that you don't actually have to prepare and it's already good and made for you. But let us hope that tonight, while we eat at Loring's Pasta Bar over there, they are not serving us the leftovers because we need the <laughs> finest cuisine. So here we are, and this is the real reason we're here. 20% off with your student ID. We've got them! Locked and loaded. And um, uh, also, a little tip, we both got water. We opted out of uh, getting <laughs> soda true. or another drink. I don't remember the last time I went out to dinner and I didn't get water. <laughs> that 250 spray, you know, that adds up. And the free bread is a bonus too. Food. More food. Because it's an Italian restaurant, I got homemade ravioli with chicken in the sauce and tomato and basil and mozzarella. And I got some chicken and vegetable pot stickers. So I think that we're both going to be pretty well off. I mean, how does it taste? I'm going to try mine. Ready? <laughs> oh! <laughs> Woo Done! Cleaned off our plates. You named it the Amber Dish. It was the Amber Dish. It was everything I love in a dish. In terms of a fancy dinner for two, that's a pretty great price, That's right? the price total. It's less than 20 bucks. Like, you can't go wrong with that. So um, we're gonna pack our stuff up and then we're going to head out to see Gravity. Gravity! We're taking the bus to the movie. And when you take the bus, you always have to use your bus pass. <laughs> so here we are, and we've got our student IDs, and that gets us $6 movie tickets. Please. Yay! Okay, here we go. We're in the movie now. Oh my god. That was crazy. <laughs> so we just came out of gravity, and our minds were pretty much blown. It was amazing. It was a visual masterpiece. I will be surprised if this movie doesn't win multiple Oscars for the cinematography and the visuals the and the art direction. The cinematography was brilliant. This was not what I was expecting. I was just expecting, you know, a normal, like, whatever, space casual... Space movie. <laughs> I thought it was going to be a space movie, but no! And on a more nerdy note, the particle animation in the explosions, I've never seen anything like that. This is revolutionary, I think. Anyway, would you say this was a successful date night, Amber? I think it was lovely. It was the best date I've had in a very long time. Amber and I have to part ways. It's really freaking cold. <laughs> Minneapolis is so chilly. <laughs> but if Sandra can survive space, then we can survive this Minneapolis winter for sure. <laughs> if it means filling you guys in. <laughs> <laughs> On a scale of A to F, how, what would you rate this date? A plus. Yay! And that's an A plus on a budget. <laughs> anyway, if you want to get an A plus date, you just got to follow these tips, bring your student ID to places. Always use your bus pass. I hope you guys learned a thing or two. Obviously, we had a blast, and I'll see you next time on The Rented Life. Okay, bye!